Hello everybody and welcome back to another video on the Anspring Art channel. In this video we're going to be playing uh, The Backrooms Lost Tape. Now if you remember the last Backrooms video we did, which was the complex, I believe this is very similar. Uh, it might be a little more involved, I think I played this before a while ago, so I think it's very similar in premise, but a little different. So uh, without further ado we're going to... Uh, Get right into it. Okay. This is Josh's tape. Flex tape. <laughs> oh. Oh boy. Alright, hey boss. As you can see, the um the people were able to clean up the place and I was able to help. Really, um, really good. Uh, that one spot that was really bad, uh, I don't, that may be an exception, but uh, everything else is clean, um, as you can see right here. I'll be moving around here a little bit to show you. And uh, yeah, it's pretty good. Um, but I'll go to room one soon. Just wanted to let you know. Oh, boy. God dang it. What? Stupid light. Uh, what? Hey, who turned that on? Oh my god. Why are these games so good, well designed? Oh my god. Where? Hello? Anyone here? Hello? Can anyone hear me? Hello? Hello? Where's my flashlight at? What? It's gone? Hello? Hello? Can anyone hear me? Hello? Oh, what is this? Oh boy. Oh god, a code? Ah. Uh, well, that's fine, guys. That's fine. It's fine. This is fine. Let me just get my phone out here. Uh, so. Something, something. Something, something. Six is something. Okay, cool. Solitude is one of the greatest obstacles a wonder can face. It is something beyond our control, something that eats away at us, little by little, killing the unwary before, uh, killing the unwary before they even realize it, before they even realize it. It is, I dare say, our deepest fear. That is why it should not come as a surprise that this cursed place we now call home has found a way to take advantage of humanity's inherent need for companionship. And a uh, six there. Second to last uh, number. Uh, is anyone here? Why would I shout? And open your notepad. Oh my god, what? What? No way. Can anyone hear me? Help! Ah! No, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, I'm not just kidding, but you know, this is, right, I'm keeping it there. So it's... Dot... Two... Wait, no, I have to make sure that it's... So one... Well, no, no. Go, go further down. One, two, three, four, a six. And this, and then this could be called, like, uh... Maybe like a pass, a pass, a uh, password or something. Okay. I hope that saved. Did it? I can't. Oh, yep. Yep, it did. Okay. Again, these games being well, very well designed. Oh, back in level zero. Nope, nothing there. God, I think I'm getting a little sick, guys. If I sound bad, that's, that's completely my bad. So, I, 
me, you know, my voice may sound a little quiet, or I may not sound the best. Oh my god. Oh my god, yes. Zoom! Zoom! What is that? What are you? A mannequin? You little mannequin. Huh? A weirdo. You're a weirdo. So a little, a little odd. Three is the third. I'm assuming that's the code. I think it is. Three is the third, so three. Okay. It's a random stool. Okay. Running into the ether. Oh, I do not like this environment. Yeah, it's like, how could you... You know, I was thinking, right, after I completed the complex, I was like, how could I not play the Lost Tape? They're basically, like, they're tied, you know. You know what I'm saying? They're kind of tied. At least I thought so. If I have one on the channel, might as well have the other, right? Oh my god. Alright, what is... Where do I go here? I'm just gonna... Hit this way. of arrow. This is obviously where we're supposed to go, right? Ah, five! Cool. Mindlessly. Does it go this way then? Or what? What is this? What is this? What is this? Do I die if I touch this? Guess not. All right. More arrows. More completely trustworthy arrows.
some construction work was going on. Jogging along. Great, this game promotes exercise, you know. What is that? I'm gonna sneeze. Oh, God. Why is it? Ah, oh, God, I'm gonna sneeze. Ow. What in the hell kind of prop hun is this? What is this? What? My name is Jennifer. What the hell? And lead researcher at SCP. I'm recording this message. SCP? Success in the task of shutting down the generator at this location, allowing that metal door to open. The problem is, apparently, this brought something from another dimension. I created a password so that the generator doesn't turn off by accident. When deciding to enter the password to be able to access another dimension, whatever it is, be prepared to run for your life. Oh, what? What was that? Alright. Okay. I'm just... Oh, God! Ah! Ah, thank you. Yeah, I can't do that. Okay, you know, I'll take a while. So there's a code or something here. Don't know where I'd find that at. Probably in this sketchy environment. Hello. Oh my god, guys, a paper. Seven. Oh my god, my eyes, dude, my eyes, my eyes. Uh, three, seven, six, five. Okay, let's try to guess it from there. Alrighty. Something, something, three, seven, six, five. This should be pretty easy to guess at this point. We only have two numbers left. I'll just take a, a little minute, but we should be able to get it. So it is. We're going to try 003765. Zero, What the fuck? I told y'all we got it. See that? Expert gamer. Expert gamer. Well, expert are we? Oh, shiza. What the hell? Man, I tell you what, playing Amnesia the Bunker makes us feel like child's play, dude. What the f frick is that? But it looks like a stick. Bro, is that an egg on your head? What is that on your head? Is that a mannequin doll? What is that? This is weird.
Oh, okay, yeah, you're gonna camp out, huh? Yeah. Go away. Oh, look at him wobble. Yeah, okay, buddy. Yeah, okay. They're a little loud. Can you turn it, tone it down a little bit? You're a little loud. Yeah, you're a little loud. Look at him walking. Yeah, you little bastard. Think I provoked him, guys? No, he's good. Look at him over there. Yep, keep walking, little buddy. Keep walking. Oh my god. How long is this gonna take? So, guys, uh. This is shrooms. They're smoking shrooms. Guys, we're in the pool rooms. Oh yeah, you're so scary. Yeah, screw off. Ah, uh, screw off. What is this? Where are we now? This could be possibly be. So I think you guys know where we could pass the beast. The pool rooms. Rooms where there are only pools. I do not like this. I don't like this. I do not like this one bit. Oh my god, the screen shaking is killing me. Oh 
God, this is hurting my head. My soul. Some package. Uh, I don't remember where I'm gonna some packages from here. Oh, yeah, there's another one. So we just keep going. Do we just keep going forward here? Oh boy, red lighting. Oh, you fucking. That's scary. That all these horror games do that. The pipe burst. The pipe burst is the cheapest form of jump scare. Literally, literally a cheap, cheap jump scare. Basically, you know where we are at this point. Yo, what? Uh. What? Oh my god. This is crazy. There we go. Get in. Get in, now we shall. that they can go through small elevators. What oh, is this some music? Getting louder. I must be dreaming. Hey, a man is falling to the river Lego City. Can someone hear me? Can someone hear me? Hello? Hello? Can someone hear me? Is anyone here? Can someone hear me? Is anyone here? Is anyone here? Is anyone here? Is watching. Oh my god. Is anyone here? Is anyone here? <laughs> Actually, I'm just gonna do that. Oh, so, that's good. Square. Well, I'd rather be here than be a square, so, you know, there's that. You know, the more I play these backrooms games, the more I realize how easy it is to make a liminal space in video gaming. Like, imagine how easy that would have been to make. You literally just have to make a big-ass room with, like, a flower pot in it, and, like, some weird location. And you basically have a liminal space. I like this liminal space stuff on this channel. See, like this? It's just a random ass prop. 
where you wouldn't expect it to be, and that's basically what liminal spaces are. Like a over abridged, oversimplified. This might be the honestly. We might be reaching the climax of backrooms games on this channel for now, until obviously the uh, the the complex expedition comes out, which is in two days actually. So that'll be really fun to review and record. And then after that, it'll probably be uh, over. Uh, and also tomorrow ends the week long streak of uploads. Uh, this week, honestly, I gotta say, my experience with the daily uploads is kind of eh. I'd rather not do it. I mean, it's not that it was bad, it's just that, you know, constantly having to record every uh, every day because I have a, you know, combined with literally every other project I have to do. It's just hard <laughs> finding time to do it. And I want to say we're uh, lacking in views because of that as well. Because of, uh, I'm because of the time restraints, I'm always having to record it and upload it at like 10, 9 o'clock at night. Did I fall in here? No, oh, no. Yeah, I always have to record it so late at night. And it's just, it's not going to get any views if we do that, so. You know, it's just... Just a little... A little excessive. I might try to uh, maybe record two videos and upload one of them one day and up and the other some other day. That just saves time. But I don't know. We'll see what what I uh, want to do here. Definitely not daily uploads. That's for sure. I mean, maybe to upload every like two days, two or three days, maybe. I'm definitely not going back to a weekly schedule. A little too, too, a little too excessive for me. There is no escape. Yeah, there is. I'm about to escape right now. Oh shit! There, oh wait. What is that? Is this man what? There is no escape. Well, I have to disagree. Personally, I believe there is an escape. You see this? But he literally just had to walk up the damn stairs and find the elevator. What a, s what a loser. Oh my god, what the hell is this? Why is my game lagging so bad? What? Why are you lagging my game? <laughs> it's just a field. Oh my god, I have to turn it off. This is literally just a field and it's dying. Dude, my game is dying. What is this? What the hell is that sound? What is this? Is this the elevator? Oh yeah, it is. What? Oh, come on now. Open up. I know you want to. Come on. Oh god, what? What? What do I have to do? Let me go up to like these are these like props or something? What is this? The f uh, okay. So I'm not gonna turn. What? Oh, are they like an an order or something? 
Okay. Alright. Did I get this one? Oh yeah, I did. Yeah, that elevator is kind of hard to see. So maybe I should approach this differently so I can like... See, is there something out here with me? Is there... Is there something out here with me? Sure hope not. Where is that goddamn elevator? Here it is. And we just have to run straight forward. Oh, wait. Not as bad as I expected. I thought it was gonna like turn pitch black or something. I suppose it's not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Alright, well, goodbye. What the hell? What? Yo! <laughs> what is this? Oh my god. I see we entered a soccer mom's garden. Oh hell no. These are cardboard. Yeah! This is a vibe! This is a vibe. Yeah, this is this is card carbs cardboard. What is that? What is that? Hey, are you grilling over here? No, that's a chair. I thought it was a grill. I thought this man was actually cooking. Jesse! Jesse! We need to- Jesse! Hey, you cut off the music. What? What's in the- Okay. So I'll just start walking. Okay. I don't know where to go. So I'll have to find the. Do I have to like go into a house or something? This one or something? No, there's something in this one though. Or like another one? Oh my god! Oh my god, Stonehenge! Uh. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Sure. This house or something? Oh wait, there's a fence here. Oh no, nothing in here. Oh, uh, this puzzle will find the house eventually. Maybe because like maybe there's an escape in the house. Oh, my eyes hurt. So maybe no. Where is any other house? Is that one over here? What the hell is that? Is that the entrance one? Okay. Oh, you're not creepy at all. What is that? 
Ah, yes. It is in one of these houses. An elevator. A levator. The levator. Thank you. Daisy, Daisy, give me your ass. What kind of ugly ass? Ugly ass music is this? Oh boy. Uh, this is not scary at all. Yeah, this is not terrifying at all. Yeah, that's sending chills down my spine. Oh, I'm not scared of you. What are you? What are you? Oh, balloon. Do I wanna? Do I wanna? Oh. Yeah, me too, man. I'm lost. Oh! Hey, now. That's not very nice. Breaking things isn't good. This is a, oh. Give me up these slide. This slidey slide. Oh, am I stuck? Oh, no. Am I stuck? I must I must no no Oh god no oh, way I can crouch never mind motorcycle Okay dude, this guy walks so slowly this what is am I supposed to go here I don't know I guess I'll find out oh you're not terrifying at all <laughs> you little bastard do that again I'll smite you actually unnerved right now oh my god oh my god oh my god okay See, these games are very atmospheric.
god. These liminal spaces, man, they're so good. It's just so unnerving. How do they make it this good? Oh, hell no. Nah. I got the Cherokee uh, enslaved in the back rooms. That's not good. I'm gonna start running. Is that... Oh, there's nothing down here. But I also kind of want to save time. Uh, no. He walks way too slowly. Uh, that's a little strange. Lighting. Oh my god! Oh, by the way, I think I'm stuck running. <laughs> yeah, I'm not hitting anything on my keyboard. I'm just stuck running. Oh, wait, there. There we go. Oh god, the low lighting area. What the hell? What is this? Oh! Is that coming from? Uh. Oh! You know what? I'm just gonna take a screenshot of you. I'm not afraid. I'm afraid. What is happening to me? Is this the end? What? What? That's a cliffhanger. I mean, not really, but, you know, it's a it. Well, that was the backroom's lost tape. Uh. Oh, wait, found in 2035? Crazy. But, yeah, that was the backroom's lost tape. It was... Okay, I don't want to, like rate these games because like you know bo both developers work extremely hard on their project and I'm sure they're really proud but in terms of like atmosphere uh, you know immersion I gotta say it was the complex that got me I, I love the com I like the complex a little better for, for my overall favorite backgrounds game it's the complex found footage so far uh, mainly because dude though that Geiger counter, that's that's what's called. Uh, in that one level, like it didn't have very many scares, but it had this atmosphere that was so good, like such a good atmosphere that I always I felt like I was on edge constantly. Like this one, although it had the same vibe of like, you know the same kind of atmosphere, I just didn't feel. A very on edge, especially after um, 
that chase scene. I mean, after that chase scene in the level zero, it was kind of like, oh, okay, well, something scary is going to happen. It's going to be a pop up, or it's going to like, there's a monster down here. You know what I'm saying? But it's like, in the complex, you never know there's a monster down here. Like, you see it slightly, but that's the only like, thing that you see of it. That and that uh, amazing audio design. Which, by the way, like, I, I have to commend this game for its audio design as well. That, that sound, that music is so unnerving. That music it made me feel unnerved. I wouldn't, like, I would be lying if I wasn't scared just a little by this game. I was. I was a little on edge. I was a little nervous. But yeah, that would be it for uh, the Backrooms Lost Tape. If you liked it, uh, subscribe, hit the bell, like maybe. You know, I'm trying to get to 100 subscribers. And if you subscribe, that'll be really nice and very much appreciated. Uh, until the next video. Uh, toodles. Oh, and before I go, the daily upload schedule ends tomorrow. Uh, it was, uh, I think it was Sunday to Sunday, last Sunday to this Sunday, uh, which is tomorrow. So, yeah. Anyway, doodles.